Hi everybody. Today we're going to show you how to convert an email message and its file attachments into a PDF document. And we're going to do it in a way that converts the email attachments so that they appear in the PDF document. We're using PST Viewer Pro software. So um, what I've got here on my screen, I've set things up for you. I've created uh, an MSG file that has uh, two email attachments. And on the right side of the screen, you can see the, uh, the attachment has uh, the MSG file is in a folder called New Folder. And I've tried to uh, label things so that you can really kind of follow along. So this MSG file is called this email has two attachments.msg. Now you can also do this with PSD files, OST files, MSG files, EML files, uh, different, different email content types. So uh, today we're just using an MSG file because, um, well, because that's what I've got. So um, this is PST Viewer Pro over here. And what I did was using the Explorer tree, I selected the new folder and uh, if there was one MSG file in that folder, which there is, then you would see one here in the mail list. If there were a thousand uh, or five thousand, it would read them all in, and you could uh, use MS. You could use PST Viewer Pro to search and find the emails you want. But just again to keep it simple today, I've just got this one email message that has two file attachments, and we're going to convert them into PDF. So this is the email. And you can see there are two attachments. Let's just take a quick peek at what these attachments look like. So I'm going to open this one up in Word. And you can see it's just, uh, you know, it says this is my Word document and a picture of a gnome. I like gnomes. And then over here, this is uh, this one is called This is a PDF document. So let's, uh, let's open that up. Uh, where'd that go? There it is. So this is my PDF document. This is a PDF document. All right, so both those files are attached to the MSG file, and the MSG file is being displayed in PST Viewer Pro. So the next step is to click on the Export button, or the Export tab, and then select from among all the different um, conversion format types that PST Viewer Pro supports. If we just wanted to embed the files inside of uh, the PDF file, then we would select Attachments Embedded, and then the, the, uh, the attachments would not be converted. They would just appear as files uh, inside, of the, uh, uh, inside of the PDF. Maybe we'll do one of those when we're done here. So what I'm going to select is PDF Attachments Converted Included. And then I make sure that my email is highlighted. I could select multiple emails here if I wanted to and it would it would convert those. Now I'm going to click the export button and then let's uh, go down here and select new folder. And when I click OK, keep an eye on the right hand side of the screen and you can see the PDF file uh, will materialize and then we'll take a look at it and open it up. OK. So there is our PDF file that's been created from our MSG file. Let's open it up. This is what it will look like. You can see the email appears up here and there's uh, the from, sent time, to, subject, attachments. The attachments are listed. And we'll scroll down. And here it says, this is my Word document. So this is the Word document that was converted into the PDF. And we'll keep scrolling down. And this is the PDF document. So uh, notice that on the left-hand side, there are what we call um, uh, bread trails. So that if you have a really complicated, you know, long PDF document, or if you have multiple PDF documents, you'll be able to tell at a glance exactly which one you are looking at. So that's uh, that's how that works. Okay, let's uh, let's just do one more export. This time we are going to use the attachments embedded option. We click on export, and um, we'll see what happens here. So because there was already a file called this email has two attachments.pdf, PST Viewer Pro detected that and knew to give the file 
uh, an incremental name so that it did not overwrite the other file. Okay, so now let's open up this one and we'll scroll down. Gee, you can see that there's, uh, there's nothing else in here <clears throat> and that there are no file attachments that have been converted. So just off the screen in this uh, viewer, I'm using PDF Exchange Viewer, it says uh, Show Attachments Pane. So I'm going to click that and you'll be able to see down here that the, the uh, files have been, uh, have been attached. And so they, they have been attached as documents. And what I can actually do is um, uh, I can just open up these documents directly. Uh, the first one here is the PDF document. So if I click on that, it appears. So, so these documents have been embedded within the PDF file and they can be extracted and used later and edited in your, your favorite software for that document type. So we thank you for watching and we hope this gives you an idea of how powerful uh, PST Viewer Pro's uh, email to PDF conversion capabilities are. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. We love to hear from you. Our email for support is supportline at encryptomatic.com and you can learn more about PST Viewer Pro at encryptomatic.com forward slash PST Viewer. Thanks for helping us make PST Viewer Pro the best application out there for converting email into PDF files. And we look forward to talking to you soon. Have a great day.